What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel for yet another video. If you're new to the channel, my name is Ty. I normally make car videos, working on my cars, driving to a bunch of different places, drifting, I do ski vlogs, and also some outdoor stuff, shooting, fishing, that kind of deal. Let's get into today's video. So, you want to learn how to sculpt cars, and obviously I've got a model in front of me, and this is going to help me describe some of the things of the basics of how it kind of works. I was first introduced to clay modeling, or clay sculpting, in 2015. I was a senior in high school, and I went to a program at GM called You Make a Difference. During the program, I got to sketch, render, and eventually build a clay model of a car of my own design. After that, I kind of fell in love with sculpting, and pretty much based my college degree around automotive sculpting. Skip four and a half years, I now work at GM full time as a contract employee and I get to sculpt cars every day. Enough blabbering for me, let's get into what the basic construction of a clay model is gonna look like and uh, if this is something you are interested, be sure to drop comments below. Any questions, I'll do my best to answer them. And yeah, let's take a look at this thing. So what we're looking at right here is a speed form clay model. This is a project that a lot of different certification courses will do. Something similar to this. It's not a car, but it is automotive-esque. I mean that in the way that the surfaces are similar to that of a car. Everything is curvature, a lot of lines, you're working on symmetry. All of that stuff is included in a speed form project. But first thing is construction. Typically on a scale model, you'll have a wood base that goes through the bottom section of the car and it usually has some legs on it. This one's very simple, so this is just a wood base here. On top of the wood base is white foam. This allows the clay to get a good hold on the foam and it'll stay there, it shouldn't go anywhere after it's pushed into here. Packing is definitely a technique and it would be something that I would get into in a future video. So as you can see here, I've got foam, so wood, foam, and then you can see this section here of clay. The clay used for automotive sculpting uh, actually is warmed up in an oven to about 150 degrees and it is applied into the foam or onto the clay surface. Then it will cool down, shrinking, and firms up so that the clay can actually be tooled on. So by pushing on this, it's not gonna do anything, but if you were to drag your fingernail through it, it leaves a mark. The next part on this example is some different levels of surfacing. This is a very rough surface, so an early surface, quick development. This is a bit more refined. Working to hard edges is definitely super important. And then a little bit more cleaned up, but still pretty rough leading up to something that's more of a finished surface. There's definitely a lot going on here, but as I said, this is just a quick run through of the basic construction of a clay model and the kind of steps that it goes through before being completed. So this would be considered a finished surface coming through here in this section. And then a lot of the time, you'll dynock a model, which is more of like a vinyl material. You can kind of see on this edge right here, it's lifting up a little bit. But uh, that's an entirely different process. We're not gonna get into that right now. But this is a very simple example of the different steps of construction, as I said. And from bare minimum, the armature. So there's a lot of different lingo and terms as well. This is the armature underneath. Then your clay is just packed on top so that's your clay surface. And then rough, medium, getting there, finished and then die knocked. That was a ton of information run down super quickly. As I said, this is a very quick and easy way to show the different steps of the process. If you guys are interested, please leave a comment below. I have another model I can strip down and start from square one with you along the way. Show you the different tools, techniques, steps to go through to go from something that is basically bare foam all the way up to a finished surface. Clay sculpting is definitely a fun career and I wanted to start a video series kind of going over how to sculpt, how to get into it. There's a ton of different colleges that offer programs about it. So as I've said a bunch of times already, if you're interested in this and you wanna see more of it, drop a comment down below and hit that like button. Also, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell because if this is something all of you are interested in, I will be putting out a bunch of more videos. 
So stay tuned for that. Hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, night, whatever time of day it is, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Let me hear.